So hey y'all, um, I was just sitting here, um, I, I'm actually preparing to record a video for a collaboration that I'm doing with BlackNerdFly.com. It's called Heart to Heart with Latrice Samson Richards. I'm running a little late in terms of getting that finished and it's because of shit like this. And I'm sitting here and I'm like, okay, I'm getting ready to do this video and I need to put on all this makeup and and I've been dreading like sitting down and recording even for the YouTube page like you know I have this page I want to grow this page I want this to be a part of what I actually do for a living you know what I'm saying so I need to increase my consistency and I keep trying to understand why I struggle so much with being consistent in doing these things because I know that this is what I want to do. There's no question in my mind about whether or not I want to, you know, be the person that provides you with information that helps you to heal and manifest in your life. Like this is what I'm here to do. This is what I'm supposed to be doing with my life. And yet even with that level or that amount of confidence in my purpose I still struggle with follow through and that doesn't make any sense to me and so I because why you know what I'm saying like why if I know what it is I'm supposed to be doing if I know because that's half the battle you know is trying to figure that out so if I understand that and I know that then why am I struggling and you know, I'm sitting here and I'm like, I put on a whole face of makeup. I'm talking about a whole fucking face of makeup. I don't wear makeup. I actually hate wearing makeup. Like, I am one of those people that I'm just like, you know what? This me. You know what I'm saying? Like, my skin is far from perfect, you know? But... This is what it is. I was diagnosed with PCOS in 2015, 16, when I was in Japan. And, you know, PCOS is difficult to deal with, you know? So, one of my symptoms is hirsutism, um, which is basically facial hair. And it, you know, it sucks. <laughs> I mean, there's, there's no other way to really put that. It fucking sucks. Like, I hate it. I hate it. I absolutely hate it. And so, you know, there's this battle. But, I, and, but as much as I hate it, it's a part of who I am. You know what I'm saying? Like, it, it comes with the package. It's a part of who I am. And it doesn't change that I'm cute, bitch. Okay? It doesn't change that. You know what I'm saying? Which means that it doesn't change how I see myself. Would I do I wish it wasn't there? Hell yeah. I wish it wasn't there. I wish I didn't have to be bothered with it. I wish I didn't have to deal with it. I just wish it didn't fucking exist. I do. But it does. And that's just the cards that I was dealt. And so all I can do is figure out the best way to manage and to deal with and you know it's difficult sometimes so i have like dark spots on my face sometimes my skin flares up you know like it's you know so i have these little dark spots or whatever and it's like the the urge is to want to cover those things up because they make you feel like if you're going to be a creator you have to be perfect damn there you know but I'm not that girl, you know, but that doesn't change the message that I have to give. And it doesn't change the fact that this is my purpose in life, you know. And so, you know, as I'm like trying to build this brand and just introduce myself to y'all and, you know, I want it. it ha it's important to me that y'all really get to know who I am not just what you want me to be because that's something that I have struggled with my entire life trying to fit into this mold of what people want me to be and I can I you know I just decided that I don't want to live like that no more and especially if you know 
my whole thing that I'm teaching us is how to be vulnerable and because I really believe in the power of vulnerability. I do. I just, it makes sense. You know what I'm saying? Like, I think it's, it's a very real thing. And that's where the basis of my teaching comes from is about authenticity and vulnerability. That is how you heal. That is how you manifest. And you just apply it in different ways. You know what I'm saying? Across every single area of your life. That is, it starts with vulnerability and authenticity. And that has always been a struggle for me personally in my own life. And so it's important to me that as I build my brand and I build, that I myself be authentic, excuse me, authentic and vulnerable with y'all because we are all on this journey together. That's it. We're all on this journey together. We're at different places or different points in our journey, but we're all on this journey together. And so I'm going to start just doing a better job of trying to capture these kind of moments or whatever because these are major moments in my own journey for me. You know, it's a big deal that I like, you know, took my makeup off and I'm doing this video and that I'm crying on the fucking video. I, for me and my own personal journey, that has always been a struggle for me. And so I'm choosing to push past it intentionally. I'm choosing to address it and confront it because confrontation yields resolution. If you don't confront it, it will never be resolved. And at the end of the day, resolution is the name of the game. <laughs> okay? Resolution. If it is not resolved, it's coming back. Point blank period. So you have to figure out what it is it's going to take in order for it to be resolved. Whatever it is. And that's where I come in. You know? I'm, as I'm learning, I'm teaching, but I already have what I need because I went to school for this. I am a therapist, a licensed professional counselor. I have been licensed in the state of Louisiana for the last eight years, about to be nine years. I went, I have a master's degree. My undergrad is in psychology and I have a minor in child and family studies. My master's is in counseling psychology. I went to school to learn how to be a counselor. I took an examination. I went through 3,000 hours of supervision. I'm a therapist in real life. This is what I do. And I'm also a certified life coach. Certified. I'm not, I didn't just wake up one day and say I was going to call myself a life coach. I went through a certification program. So... I know what the fuck I'm talking about. You know what I'm, saying? <laughs> I'm also a law of attraction certified provider. I I actually have studied these things and I also have my own personal experiences and the experiences of the hundreds, possibly thousands of clients that I have worked with over my career. And I'm just trees. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So I would hope that you would. I just wanted to share this moment with y'all. Um, you know, let me know what your struggles are. Have you had any major breakthrough moments here lately? Um, you know, I just needed to get that off my chest and I feel better about it. I'm going to finish washing my face because my skin is not awesome. So I have to, I have to put a lot of work into my skin. So if you know of anybody that has a really good skincare line or anybody that y'all got any tips for large pores, cause I be doing the best I can. You know all that. <laughs> and y'all make sure you comment, um, make sure that you subscribe. I'm new to this. I'm still learning. But I hope that you all take this journey with me. And um, that's it. I love y'all. And I appreciate y'all. And until next time, be well. Bye, y'all.